YouTube, what's going on, man? It's your boy, Boba, and welcome back to another FIFA 23 play review on the channel. I hope you guys are having an incredible day. As you guys know, we are getting an end of an era SPC every day at 6 p.m. And in today's video, we're going to go ahead and check out the new Marco Asensio card. Asensio is a 91 rated card with 93 pace, 89 shooting, 88 passing, 93 dribbling, 52 defending, and 79 physical. He stands at 6 feet tall, has high medium work rates, left footed with 4 star skill moves and 4 star weak foot. We do see a bit of versatility with the card, which is always great to see he can play right wing right mid and then also striker his in-game stats show us that he could potentially be a pretty solid card for only a hundred thousand coins 93 pace with 94 acceleration and 92 sprint speed is pretty decent for an attacking player 89 shooting not the greatest of stats especially at this time in fifa he does have 88 attacking positioning with 86 finishing probably a chemistry style to bump that up a bit more 88 passing again another solid stat for the card he does have 87 vision with 88 crossing 88 short pass and 89 long pass 93 dribbling is probably where the card is going to go ahead and excel the most now he does have 91 agility with 88 balance which is pretty decent 88 reactions 96 ball control 93 dribbling and 92 composure 52 defending but not really going to be defending with asensio and then he does have 79 physical 73 jumping 94 stamina is huge 80 strength and 60 aggression we don't see many added bonuses to the card which is a bit unfortunate but he does have the long shot taker player trait if we jump on over to footbin we can see that asensio does have the average body type which is pretty decent in fifa 23 he can only have the control acceleration type so personally i'm gonna go ahead and give him my hunter chemistry style is gonna max out his pace at 99 and it's also gonna really bump up his attacking positioning to 92 and his finishing to 94 if you guys do enjoy these fifa 23 play reviews go ahead and do me a huge favor if you guys can leave a like on today's video and also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new it would be greatly appreciated this is the team boys that we're going to be using in three games of the ultimate team of the season cup to test out the new asensio card we're going to be playing him at the center forward position in a 4-3-2-1 formation so without further ado let's go ahead and jump into it let's see how good this card really is boys no way this guy is redless man he has red mbappe red lewandowski red musiala and red and cuckoo no way all right boys so we conceded very early on but i do want to go ahead and test out asensio's dribbling and as you guys can see he is quite quick and swift on the ball nothing too crazy but you can definitely do some nice dribbling with him oh that's good positioning right there from asensio good ball as well into morientes so far, his passing's also been pretty decent. Asensio, nice little tackle right there, doing the defensive work. Nice little interception. Morientes, good ball. Del Lafeu, I'll whip it in back post. Asensio, we'll take it, boys. Okay, he doesn't have the craziest of jumping, but he did get over noon men's. We'll take that. 2-1, first goal for the club. Nice. Almost got the pass off. I will say that the dribbling right there just felt a little bit slow. Almost created a really nice chance for us. Nice little tackle. We could spring into a counterattack. Asensio. Nice little ball roll. Oh, it's a lovely ball into Mbappe as well. Should finish. Come on, boys. Asensio with an assist. Calm, cool, and collected. That was a great pass. Inch perfect. Mbappe. Asensio. Nice touch. Just a bit slow on the ball sometimes. Oh, that's a good ball. Near post. Oh, we should be scoring right there with Asensio, but we do get the rebound. We'll take that. Pretty decent attacking position. The finishing could have been a bit better. We do have some more time. It's not over yet. Asensio. The heel to you. Cuts it back. Quaradona. Come on, boys. That's lovely. That's lovely center forward play right there. Asensio. I will say that his physical side to his game is actually not too bad. He doesn't have the craziest of physical stats, but he can definitely hold off a defender. Orientes. Good ball, Asensio. The playmaker. Zizou near post. Oh, should have been an assist right there, boys. Oh, Asensio doing work. This guy's tactic really works for him. Nice one-touch football. Asensio, power shot. Why not? Weak foot. Ooh, that's a pretty decent attempt. Asensio is the man short. I might actually try to like hit a finesse shot with him. Why not? Asensio? That's nice. That is nice, boys. We'll definitely take that. Over top. Quaradona. It's a good ball, Asensio. Oh my god, he actually has the pace. Chip it. Oh, it's off of the crossbar, boys. That would have been brilliant. That would have been brilliant. That was really good pace against Alfonso Davies. Nice. See if we can play out of the press. Oh, Asensio, that's a good take. 
That's a good take. We'll definitely draw the foul right there. Sensio. Oh, that's a lovely ball. Kylian Mbappe. Asensio finish. Come on, boys. Just before the end of the match. Asensio with the fantastic ball. Gets the return. 2-2, two -two, man. Oh, can we find the game winner? No way. Asensio. Near post. Oh, it was a decent attempt. Wrong shot type probably by me. All right, boys, here we are jumping into our final game using the end of an era Marco Asensio card. And to be completely honest, I thought we were going to get scored on right there. But to be completely honest, I do think that it's a pretty solid card. I don't think that he's anything too crazy for 100,000 coins and 84 and 85 rated team, I do believe. If you do run a La Liga team, I think you can go ahead and complete it. But if you don't, I don't think it's the end of the world. Nice interception. Asensio near post has to be come on boys that's a clean finish I will say that he's actually pretty clinical nice little interception we'll take that C2 Asensio oh lovely dribbling still with it maybe did too much come on boys we'll take the assist that's beautiful the dribbling right there just to evade the goalkeeper challenge nice man you know what might actually be able to get it to Asensio nice go for a dink Oh, Petr Cech, good save, good save. Play quickly into Zizou. Oh, he's gone for the offside trap. He's moved his goalkeeper, Asensio, boys, come on. Clinical, man, that's a great finish to the near post. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That is us using the new end of an era Marco Asensio card in a few games of the Ultimate Team of the Season Cup. And to be completely honest, I do think that it's a pretty decent card for roughly 100,000 coins, but I don't think that he's meta or anything crazy. The three pros that I did win this with the card were definitely his pace, his shooting, and then also his dribbling. Really good pace on the card overall. He does have 93 pace with 94 acceleration and 92 sprint speed. He does feel quite rapid in game, especially with the Hunter chemistry style. 89 shoot another decent stat for the card like i said he has 88 attacking positioning with 86 finishing it's not the craziest of stats but he was quite clinical in those three games and then last but not least in the standout stat in my opinion his 93 dribbling 91 agility with 88 balance he actually felt quite quick and swift on the ball which was great to see so boys we come to the question is this spc worth it and i'm gonna go ahead and say yes if you do run a la liga santander team like i said the spc is really cheap and 84 and 85 rated team is gonna cost you roughly 100 000 coins to complete and for that i do think you're getting a pretty solid card now if you don't go ahead and complete the spc i don't think that it's the end of the world to be honest i do think that there are wingers in la liga that are better than the asensio card to be completely honest i do think that yannick carrasco is a bit better than him he reminds me a bit of chukweze maybe just with a bigger build overall i'm gonna go ahead and give the card in the spc an 8.8 .8 out of 10 rating like i said it's a solid card nothing too crazy if you complete the spc you can definitely use him uh, he's still usable in june but i don't think that he's anything crazy if you don't end up completing the spc it's not the end of the world uh there's better wingers out there but that is going to be the end of today's video if you guys did enjoy go ahead and smash the like button comment down below what player you guys would like to see next in another fifa 23 player review and then also consider subscribing to the channel if you are new thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for clicking on today's video i've been your boy Buba, and i'll catch you guys in another one very very soon peace